Welcome to my video comparison between Fraps and Wii Game using the Crisis Benchmark. So as you can see we have both uh, video recording software to record at full video quality and at 30 frames per second. Here is the system that I'm running this on. So here we go. We have Fraps on the right and we have Wii Game on the left. So we'll get into the uh, specific frame rate uh, averages in a moment, but let's watch the video. And as you can see, we have Wii Game, which is on the, uh, the left. You can already tell that the video is a little bit darker than the Fraps video. I'm not quite sure why this is. It, it turned out to be like that in every video I took of the benchmark. So whether this is just in crisis or is it just a whole Wii game thing, I don't know. But you'll notice that Wii game has sort of a, a darker look to it than the Fraps video. Also, uh, whichever, whichever video recording software is the best will finish first because it rendered out the frames the fastest. So just watch for that. So here we are, Fraps has finished its run, and Wii Game is still running, and it has quite a distance to go. Now I know you're only seeing this one time, it's only one loop of the uh, the benchmark, but um, in, in subsequent loops it's pretty much the exact same thing, there is no difference, it's quite, quite a similar uh, thing that happens here. So Fraps does seem to be the better uh, game recording tool, at least for Crisis anyways. I'll do more for maybe other games. So there we are, Wii Games has finished its run, and uh, why don't we take a look at some of the, the hard numbers from the benchmark tool. So let's take a look at the benchmark without any recording software running. We can see it's all on very high, and we have a, our average frames per second are 25.02. It'll be interesting to note that Fraps recorded quite quite close to the average FPS of, of this benchmark. So. We'll take a look at that in a second. So here is our Fraps benchmark. We can see that the average FPS is 23.89, which is only just about one frame lower than if we were to run it without any uh, video software, video capturing software at all, which is quite interesting, actually. Um, Fraps usually kills your FPS, but here it seems to excel just about. Um, why don't we take a look at the Wii game benchmark now and see the difference between Wii game and Fraps. So there it is, there's our Wii game benchmark. You can see it ran at an average FPS of 15.23, which is very, very poor. Um, we can see very clearly that Fraps has defeated Wii game like by a mile here. And uh, I would recommend Fraps over Wii game any day for recording on Crisis, or most likely this this will happen on any other game as well. So just, uh, yeah, that's, that's it. Fraps wins.